So I'm going to program voice 3, why not? It's quite a nice sound, let's see if we can make it better. Um, and I will show you now, I'll, I'll take you through um, DCO1 and there you can see, uh, and if I just show you the waveforms above as well, that's your set of choices. So in this case it's gone with resonance and nothing else. Uh, and it's it probably has mixed it down, so it's just kind of bit of interest over the main sound if I click the um, DCO2. Oh no, they're both resonance sounds, that's very interesting. Hmm. Well, uh, plenty of scope to do a bit of additive synthesis here because well, if we go back to the first waveform, I can completely change the sound by choosing the combinations of waveforms. So um, at the moment, uh, if we run through, so, you're hearing a bit of fuzz from the, the other um, oscillator. If I now change line select to just one, you're now only hearing what I'm playing. Buttons are dodgy because it's old. <laughs> Tends to happen when you add in a second waveform, it lowers the pitch. Acts as a sub oscillator, sorry. Not on that one, that's interesting. And of course there's an eight stage envelope that mix goes in with this and in here they've made it very simple. It has to have an end and all that says is how quickly, that's the rate, do you get to the end point. So the envelope, which could be eight stage, has a rate which is how quickly do you get to the level which is what you see. And don't forget this affects the pitch. So it's just a slight uh, more before it gets to the, the stable pitch. Now if we start playing with this, and that's right, I should be showing you. Now we've gone through the waveforms, let me show you this programming section here. Um, the crucial stages are the sustain and the end. And at the moment it's showing end. If I press end, it, it's not the end anymore. And probably the next one, all oh, right. Two, step three, step four, step five, all the way through to the end. There you go. And in their synthesis book, they explain this quite well. So let's just pull up that book. The three examples they give with eight stage envelopes, apart from a wah wah effect, are shown here. So, whereas normally you've got an ADSR, which is four stage, uh, here you can make things that are much more complex and model the real world. Here's another example where the decline is gradual and deliberate rather than um, the same over time. And here they've got a tonguing effect by playing with the way the note starts. So much for theory, let's just have a bit of practice here. So in our Example, we've got eight stages, but let's go back. I'm just going to show an extreme example, and we're getting to try and to model on a, another video series. But at the moment, if I was to um, take my time, so I'm going to lower the rate, and I'm going to up the level. That should rise in pitch now. <laughs> There you go, because we've got step one going all the way up at a slow rate to the top pitch and then step two, and they're not doing much, so it quickly gets to the, to the end step. Great for those, um, <laughs> those simply things where you hold it down, hang on, listen. Etc. <laughs> Fun. But, 
you probably don't want to be quite so obvious as that so you might just want to um, vary it a little bit Oops. well that's interesting oh, I've owned these since on and off for years and I didn't I've forgotten that you can step round from eight back to one again just by going down and up that's handy it is otherwise slightly klutzy way of programming they didn't have they didn't think of wheels back in those days um, actually I lie because I have a broken Akai AX80 and that has a wheel on it so uh, we're going to change the level we're going to make it not quite so crazy wobble as it starts up so that's so much for the uh, DCO you can play with pitch um, you can make things come and go in fact let's take them up on that example they said about the wah wah I will now program the wah wah as described I'll show you it pause and program it how to create a wah wah sound let's take them up on that here we go Okay, I'm on step seven. I've just got to do step eight. Jeez. 20, right, zero. And. Sorry, level zero, rate 20, okay. Okay, that's it. Well, I have no idea if this is going to work or not. Well, quite fast wah wah, I think you'd agree. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that quite works. But uh, I guess it's done what I've expected, which is varying the pitch. Not something you want to do that often, I would probably suggest. So let's move on to the DCW.